when we heard that the shop was struggling and it looked like it was really going to maybe be the final blow, which was late of 2018, you know, maybe autumn of 2018, Lynn and I basically called each other with the same idea. We said, what can we do? Like, we have to find a new place. Like, this, this store must be here. It, it's, it's so much a part of us, but it's so much a part of tens of thousands of people who have had their own relationship and experience. Tommy and Lynn, you know, developed in the Heights at the Old Drama Bookshop, and this institution is so meaningful in their lives, and now in the cultural landscape of, you know, New York City and shows in general, that, um, that they would like sort of save it and preserve it is this an extraordinary thing. You know, when we were on 40th Street, the Niederlander was a block away, right? Like, you know, Broadway was right there. And so for us, staying in this area was a, a real priority. Their hope and dream was that if you, you know, live and work in the neighborhood or live in the city or you're fresh off of a bus from Port Authority or you're coming off a train, that you're going to find your way here. And I think we feel really fortunate and it's like a perfect bookend, finding a place a block away from the original. My hope for the space is that it's an incubator just like it was for me and countless other <laughs> young theater makers or people that just love the theater. Be here, be a part of this community. And I think in this moment, coming out of what we're all coming out of, a safe place to go and congregate in the theater district where we can go and be part of this movement of reemergence. here we are. Have a cup of coffee and stay.